All right. Now we're doing Freight Code Camp, JavaScript Algorithms and Data Structures Beta. Learn form validation by building a calorie counter. Step 38. All right. So now we need to target the input container class element within the element that has our target ID. We'll declare a new target input container variable and assign it the value of document.query selector, right? Uh, then we're going to use concatenation to separate target ID and uh, input container with a, the period, pardon me, dot input container in a string with a space and pass that string to query selector. Honestly, I have no idea what we're, what we're trying to do right now. I mean, I feel like maybe I should have done the entire course and then come back and uh, went through the, and, got, and gone through this thing. Cause like right now, this is a mystery. I mean, honestly, but I know what we're gonna do here. We'll do const, uh, we're gonna do const and we're gonna make the target input uh, container variable because we're declaring the new target input, pardon me, target, target input container variable, right? So that's gonna equal something. Uh, and then it, we're gonna assign it the value of document.query selector, right? So we'll do doc document dot, oops, dot query selector. All right. And we're gonna use concatenation to separate target ID and this uh, dot input container with a space and pass that string into the query selector. So inside of here, we're gonna do target ID, so it's this thing here, all right? And we're gonna add that to a string with a space and dot input hyphen container, all right? So, I mean, this this is gonna work. I already know it, because I already did this in rehearsal. Uh, and if we do this, we say console.log target ID, all right? We come over here, open up the console, and then run this thing, add entry. Whoops, add entry like that. We're gonna see it does say breakfast, right? But when we put this inside of the console.log, ah, uh, I don't know, it's just an empty, uh, it's just an empty object. So I still, it's still a mystery to me what's going on right now, what we're even doing this for, uh, but hopefully we'll figure it out in the next few. Uh, so let's check the code, looks good and submit it. All right, now we're on to step 39 and we'll see you next time.